Hello, Twitch. The ghost I've told you we'll begin with. There's it. With the Dino Crisis tool. Let's hit play the game. Let's go for normal. Why the fuck not? One year has passed since the third energy incident. Dr. Kirk's research on third energy has been taken over by a government agency, and massive research has begun at a base somewhere in the Midwest. However, in their pursuit of immediate results, they have failed to take the necessary precautions, and once again, an accident has occurred. This time, the entire research base, military institution, and a small town close by have disappeared. In their place, there now lies a jungle from another time. May 10th, 2010. I'm about to step through a gate into another time. Or maybe it's another world. I'm being sent in with other members of TRAD. Our mission? To rescue 1,300 survivors and collect data on the Third Energy Project. How the fuck did they hide that in the bush? those two to survive. Dino Crisis 2. Okay. So, this is the Cretaceous way of welcoming guests, huh? Yep. Not exactly the red carpet treatment. Hmm. There's no response. I'm what? The I'm just pretty cut sure there. my team's alright. Why don't you have a pink hair? Let's get moving. Now hold on. What was your name again? Hey! <laughs> Why's your hair red, not pink? The ivy is wrapped around the door. It won't open. Let's try the door over there. Oh, come on. Didn't they teach you how to open a door at sort training? Here, I'll show you. What Watch a this. fucking dick. <coughs> so manly. Uh, yeah. That weapon definitely suits a trap member. But I prefer to go in this way. See ya, Mr. Barbarian. 
Hey, the name's Dylan. Call me that when you need some help, okay? Let's do that donut. When they close it before. Come on. Jeez. Good grief. No damage to himself. This is definitely a thing from a completely um, detached version. Come on.
Jeez, what is wrong with you, computer? Do not mean to do that. The place is there. Hey, who are you? Are you one of the survivors? Oh, can you stop, awesome computer? Don't run away. Come he out. already did. Jeez. We came here to rescue you. I wish this computer would stop clicking the to hard drive. Come on, some time this century. Oh, come on, Swift's Caesar four and four point eight meters, one point eight meters high. Observation records we originally thought of dinosaurs were just slow and dumb reptiles. So we soon realized that. Wasn't true at all. The Velociraptor proved us all wrong. The clones on each foot is sharp as a blade, no shit. Providing for a powerful slash, making them a killing machine. The long, hard tail is used as balance when running at high speed. In high speed, yeah, I would not have guessed. However, it is also used as a weapon. Well, I'm pretty sure that's just bollocks, really. But what do I know? Their tails, tail whip is so powerful that it can shatter bones. Well, that just shatter its own bones. Combat notes. When and if you encounter them, never show your back to them. The moment you start running away, you become prey, a, a prey a to them. I'm pretty sure that A should not be there. No shoulders, shoulder, no shoulder. No soldier has come back alive, running away from them. Sure, the basic rule in this world is to fight, just like any uh, military personnel fight to the death. The raptors are the most prosperous carnivorous, carnivorous dinosaurs in the world. You don't know that. They're, they're, like, they live different, different flocks. They live different flocks in various areas. Their behavior and endurance are not all similar, but they all have one thing in common, speed. They are fast. It is best not to use heavy weapons. Also, on very rare occasions, there have been encounters of blue raptors reported. Their attack and toughness are said to be ultra raptor, raptor levels. I see what you did there. Go hunt them down if you dare to claim yourself as a real hunter. Come on, stop glitching out. Oh, I can save you. No, can I? Hang on, hold. 
let's have a look at this shop. Come on. 18,000 points. This is a lot of different. This is definitely a lot different to the original Dino Crisis. I uh, don't think I like it. It's locked from the other side. Can't be unlocked from this side. Mm. I wouldn't have guessed. Can you just be a stupid computer? It doesn't seem to like. It doesn't seem like rough spot probably caused by the rain of this one. Can you stop looking at the fucking thing? Jeez. This computer needs to be replaced. Period. Oh, fuck it off. Rubbish in the rubbish is blocking the tunnel path. There seems to be more some of some sort on pieces of concrete. So the points is just for buying sh shit at the, the uh, shop. Fucking BA. I need this computer to fuck off. Big term. Don't know if you can hear it.
talking to you. So the reception desk it appears as though nobody has sat here for a very long time. Really? You just behave. Please. Get fucking grief. Sorry for the swearing, but it's just. I've quite literally had enough of this computer. Doctor's Papers Limit Time Shift. Again, the day has come. January the 14th. This is the day when the th third energy accident occurred and we were sent to this time. This is the tenth time this day has come. And everything I feel, and every time I feel the same despair. The medical supplies from the med room has all been used up in the very first year. Since then we've been collecting wild plans to make medicine without knowing the effects. Nevertheless, they were used to he in healing the wounds of the soldiers and we all could do was to wait for the res rescue. Why haven't they come to rescue us? I've thought about the question for the past ten years. <laughs> And I have come to a conclusion. The time shift or fold is caused by the overdrive of the third energy. But our current technology level hasn't, uh, wasn't high enough to recover the, recover the accident years of technology research still would not be enough. A time error of 10 or 20 years is insignificant to a time slip of 65 million years. But that error, that error, that time difference could mean everything for us. We should have never laid our hands on a toy so dangerous. Oh, Doctor. The flesh has been ripped from the stomach to his legs. Looks like a few years have passed since his death. Many of the patient's records indicate symptoms never heard of before. You got the key plate. He must have been attacked while in his sleep. There's no sign of resistance. He's a bloody skeleton for Pete's sake. How do you know if there's any signs or not if the Save. Anyway, I'm going to end the stream here until the next time, ladies, gentlemen, whoever else. The best man for me, keep because I will be back for breakfast. Fair.